This must be a record. We're doing two videos in less than 24 hours. I know. It's definitely a record. <clears throat> so what brings about this particular video? Oh, my God. Okay. So, you know, my ID, as we talked about yesterday, still reads Mark Angelo Cummings, you know. And I mean, yesterday I Is went to... Is that a problem? That it reads Mark Angelo Cummings? Yeah, because we went out to eat today and you didn't freak anybody out. No, actually we didn't. And like, people knew it was me. <laughs> and they didn't balk or, or get, I thought for sure they were going to give me some strange look or something. It was like, oh, how are you guys doing today? Fine, whatever. They serve us, you know, regular questions, blah, 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 nothing. So you guys are leaving on the 10th and all that stuff. And I'm going, oh, I see you guys had a yard sale the other day. <laughs> it's like, how do these people yeah. know? Because of the lives. Grant County goodies. <clears throat> so for people that sign up for Grant County goodies, you always get a new, like when there's a new notification or anything like that. So they like, either they like nosy on our profile and saw and just kind of because there wasn't even like, you know how usually when that somebody's. Week, by the way. Huh? It's all that. Week, but <laughs> what? What about it? It's just. Flying away. That's oh, the, the, the biggest wind. problem today, isn't it? It's the wind. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway, it's I now lost my train of thought because no, those like, people, those people at the restaurant. No. And you were talking about Grant County goodies. Yeah, I lost my train of thought. So what do you mean you lost? My I train lost of, my train of thought. You, just you haven't even been on estrogen. How <laughs> could you lose your train of thought? I did. You know, I don't know why I was doing <clears> something, and then you just interrupted me. Oh, I'm sorry. Train I didn't mean to. You know, so sometimes I do that. Yeah, you do that a lot. But anyway, so we we uh, had to go to Walmart, and we it was going to be a storm, so we decided to buy a couple of glasses of wine, uh, not glasses, bottles of wine for the storm. And I'm thinking they're going to ID me, and you know my ID, bald hair and the goatee. And so I brought my name change, even though the name change was from Maritza Cummings to Mark Angel. Can you see that over here? Because I feel like I'm talking. Like if I talk to you, the camera doesn't. I, I can see. I, yeah, I, but then I have to do this, and then I'm giving people the... Oh, because uh, look at the headroom. Oh. If I go any further, oh, okay. I'll be here. <laughs> okay. No, it's not that. I'll Let's be just here do then. That's no, fine. Go no. ahead. Back. Right My there. head cut off. Anyway, so I won't look at you. I have to look at them. Yeah. So um, I'm thinking this is going to be a problem, so I brought my citizen papers again and my legal name chain from Maritza to Mark. So I, I would have to say it's like... Huh? I was just saying life is complicated. <laughs> Very complicated. So um, we get to the checkout and you know, put all the stuff, some of the groceries and the wine, and do you have some ID? And I'm like, okay, here we go. I pulled out the mark ID, gave the mark ID thing, and she's going to ask me the same year or whatever. And she goes like this. She goes, hmm. okay, thanks. And I'm like, I'm waiting for the, this is not you, or something like that. So I'm like, no. welcome to the world of cross-dressing. <laughs> Whoever thought a woman would have to deal with the things that cross-dressers deal with? I mean, well, a woman that's been on hormones, androgen hormones, for 13 years, that has killed her femininity and killed... Womanhood by trying to be something she was not is what has to deal with it. So, you know, all those young transgender males out there that think it's so cool, you know, make sure this is what you want because it's not that easy to go all the way around. And, and the wig thing. I like can't, today, you've been. Yeah, this wig <laughs> is another one I'm you know, playing it's, around. It's and not, I, I like it. Say a wig. No, I like it. It's nice and, you know, but it was windy. And what do you say? It's flyby or what, is, what were you saying earlier? No, it, it just, the hair is just kind of... Well, it's because of the wind. Matted. So it's I like, had that, because I had And the, then if I pull on it, you're going to get mad at me. Cause, no, you could pull on it. Because <clears> it messes it up. No, it's just but, that I had the coat and then... But the wind know, was blowing. The wind blows and in it's like gets all over the place but it's a nice wig I like it it's just very long and having stuff I like the way my face looks with it we're making a video baby I know I was just looking at myself <laughs> it's like, it's not still... a well it is a camera but it's not yeah but you know, not... I'm just still like amazed with 
what I see. Although I don't understand how that lady is <laughs> so bald you know, guy it's a lot with like, a goatee. It's a lot like a crossdresser. It is. You know, going. Yeah. You know. Uh, so I say I could empathize with trans sisters because I am going through exactly what you're all going through. No different. And did yeah. I prove it? <laughs> I was like. You know, I was thinking that the woman would be like, okay, Annie, can I see your real ID? <laughs> not not you, had, you had your citizenship. I had everything with me just in case, you know, it wasn't going to fly. Which is, but she was like, okay, thank you. I'm taking my ID back on. But aren't you going to ask her something else? No. This didn't look like me anymore, does it? <laughs> so I'm like, I guess I still look like me, just with a wig and makeup. Okay. <laughs> It's it's crazy though to think that that's the kind of thing that you know you literally have to endure now. Yeah. You know, and we just you know started going down this road, you know more so. Yeah. So it's one of those things that we're going to have to confront. Oh, you know. there was something else we were going to talk about. Something else we said. Right? About the blizzard that's coming? No, but we could talk about the blizzard that's coming. It's, there's like a fire danger outside, but tonight it's supposed to snow like four to six inches. That's a half a foot, just about. Yeah. And it's like, can we just leave the fort already? I don't know, but we can because we're still waiting for flags. And, and we still don't know where we're going to live. No. Well, we kind of. Excuse me, we kind of, we know it's Hollywood, and we're looking, because it's still oh, season. Yeah, these are my pecs, boobs, <laughs> things, whatever they are. <laughs> they look like boobs. You, you just like to make fun of me. This is a trans you woman. You anything. Yeah, I did. You still have boobs. I got rid of my breasts, I mean, but they're getting back. But that was without any estrogen. Imagine with estrogen. Oh, I know. When I started taking it back. You know? It'll definitely probably. Thing is, my nipples got messed up because he did a nipple regrafting thing, so I don't have any work. I'm not gonna want to show that. Like no, that. I'm not gonna show my nipples. I mean, I'm sure they've seen it before. I've had plenty of shirtless shots. Yeah, but not as a woman. No, and I'm not gonna do that because that would be disrespectful. <laughs> so, what's what's the plan then? Did you see that video of that person that has like this glued-on hair? Oh, yeah. Yeah, but I heard that's just as expensive and not more than transplant, which makes no sense to me. But I don't understand how it could be more expensive. Because it's a special type of piece. It's a special. I mean, you saw how real it looked. I know, but still, it's like a piece of turf. (laughs) (laughs) You know, that they just, like, stick on your head. A piece of turf. Yeah. There was something else we wanted to say. I said, I'm going to talk about this when we make the video. And now I forgot. I don't know. I don't know what else was there. Uh, we have less and less stuff now, though. Yes, we do. We're able to get rid of even more, more stuff. So now it's just our now clothes. It's just us. Us, our clothes, and our instrument. And that's it. And our laptops. And, and furniture. And wigs. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, at first, Maritza didn't really want to deal with wearing wigs. And I think she still doesn't want to deal with wearing wigs. <laughs> I mean, they're okay, right but, you know, it's like, it feel, I feel like I have something going on in my head. And I have massive. What? Arachnophobia? No, it's like, I don't like stuff on me. You know, it's like hypersensitivity. Mm. So, like, and I'm dealing with it. It's like, it's not as bad. Like, before it would have been like, I could, I I would have to pull it off. Mm -hmm. But. So, does it bother you to have it like going on your head? No, not really. On your neck? It's the thing feeling on my head. It's a thing feeling. Yeah, the, this feels like something's like grabbing my skull, which there is because the wig has that thing. But it's pretty. I like it. Yeah, it's. I like it. I a bought lot. a lot of wigs when I was in. Yes, Minnesota. you do have a lot of wigs. Literally, probably have around twenty wigs. Mm. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Twenty. Twenty. And they're all range from. Short, really super expensive tall super cheap yeah. and that's the thing though that 
you know, back then, it's like there was nothing I could do. And I know exactly how you feel, you know. Because my own hair is growing in really well, but, um, you know, I still cheat with wigs and stuff like that. And last year... I'd be happy to have what you have. I wouldn't be worried about how what you have, but that's me. Yeah. Yeah, it's true, you know, but it's like, I don't know, I'm, I'm my own worst enemy. I would just be wearing a little whatever, and I'm all in here, but I have nothing. I've got a bald head with gray, and I look like Grandpa Moses with... <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa Moses? <laughs> yep. Who is that? I don't know, something Grandpa is Moses. Is he some hick? Guy from the south or something, something like with a that. beard? Something. You don't have a beard anymore. No, but my hair, I still looks like, ugh. It's got this big old bald spot. Although some hair is growing on it, but it's not growing fast enough. It looks like it grew pretty fast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Great. <laughs> there was something else, and I can't remember it now. It's going to really eat at you. Isn't it, it is, because we said, oh, we could talk about that too, remember? But why is that? Like, when did you say that? Earlier, before like we earlier even started. Like, I think from coming from Walmart. We talked about what we were going to talk about. We were talking about, you know, um, wearing wigs and it falling out of, you know, like hair oh, issues. Guess, and then, so. you know, what you did at Walmart. We already yeah. talked about that. We're kind of boring people now. Okay, so I guess we're going to say goodbye. Love you guys, but remember to love yourselves too. Bye-bye.